Every day, the princess would make a loving breakfast for her husband, but she wasn't happy at all. After her dragon husband left, a warrior came in to rescue the princess, but the next moment, the warrior told the princess that she had to eat a good meal to defeat the dragon. Immediately, the princess made a loving breakfast for the warrior. After eating, the warrior fell asleep right away. The dragon returned home with a prey in its mouth, saw the princess admiring the warrior's face, and became furious, rolling up his sleeves. He was ready to kill the warrior. The next moment, the warrior woke up, punched the dragon, and knocked it down. Then, holding the princess, the warrior jumped out of the castle. Turning back, he grabbed his big sword and slew the dragon, exhausted from the effort. The warrior collapsed and fell unconscious. The princess decided to cook the dragon meat to reward the warrior. But, unexpectedly, a monster was attracted by the aroma. Taking advantage of the warrior's deep sleep, it assassinated him. The next day, the monster brought the princess back to the palace, demanding that the king marry her to him, and the princess was about to have a wedding with the half-monster. Suddenly, the door burst open it was the warrior. Resurrected, with a gentle kick, the monster turned into ashes. And so, the princess and the warrior were together.